the nature of memory, or more specifically, its elusive and sometimes entirely subjective nature, has been at the heart of my own neurological research. Over the last century, countless studies into the use of techniques such as hypnotherapy and NLP have clearly demonstrated that the human mind is an extremely endowment. Darkness and isolation eventually came to an end. Suddenly, I had new experiences. I saw conflicts, I saw suffering, I saw pain. But I saw a choice. A mission. We needed answers. We needed to find somewhere safe. We needed to find the frozen forest. Frozen Force was just an idea. Dr. Salim's fucking therapy session for the Black Project's test subjects. This isn't the Frozen Forest. You're still fighting it. Even through all its confusion, Corvus only ever wanted to help us. She's gone. But you... You can still make it here. You can live forever. You've just gotta hang in there a little longer. You can breach the central server, you can run an executive override to purge your DNI. You can end this thing once and for all. You've just got to hang in there a little longer. You can breach the central server, you can run an executive override to purge your DNI. You can end this thing once and for all. Listen only to the sound of my voice. Let your mind relax. Drift. Let the bad memories fade. Let peace be upon you. Surrender yourself to your dreams. Let them wash over you like the gentle waves of the bluest ocean. Let them envelop you, comfort you. Imagine somewhere calm. Imagine somewhere safe. Imagine yourself in a frozen forest. Cognitive neural interfacing isn't just science fiction. We're fast approaching a reality where it will allow us to remove specific memories of severe psychological trauma with the same surgical precision with including any physiological anomaly. You're standing in a clearing. The trees around you so tall they touch the sky. White snowflakes fall all around. You can feel them melt on your skin. You are not cold. It cannot overcome the warmth of your beating heart. Can you hear it? You have only to listen! Do you hear it aloud? Do you hear it flowing? 
You're slowing it! You're in control! Scrupulous regimes and individuals for their own uncertain goals. This would be a tragedy. for the frozen forest, the further away it became. In our search for answers, we found ugly truths. The project that led to my birth also caused the deaths of hundreds of thousands of souls. I wanted to find a place of safety for all of us. I wanted an end to death, but I couldn't escape it. Death was carved into the hearts of every single soul I encountered. I don't know if I made Tim fire the shot, or if he did it of his own free will. Do you know? It's all wrong. I didn't kill those people. D and I were supposed to make everything better. Instead, Corvus has got all these pieces. But it doesn't know what it is! There's so much noise in my head, I can't even think! Who am I? Who are you? I don't even know your name! Who are you? Why do you fight? This is your last chance! Show me what you're made of! Fight it! Fight it! Listen only to the sound of my voice. Let your mind relax. Let your thoughts drift. Let the bad memories fade. Let peace be upon you. You are in control. What's your name, soldier? In a frozen forest. I said, what's your name? Taylor.
Human bio-augmentation has become commonplace throughout the developed world. The sheer scale of this disaster has overwhelmed the authorities. Superstorms continue to hammer the region, hampering relief efforts. These are uncertain times. Our future depends upon the choices we make. As populations continue to expand, megacities emerge worldwide. The extreme conditions have led to a vast exodus. The NRC are going to be here soon. We got about one minute to create the mother of all distractions. Tower, I need all traffic diverted from runway one nine.